What's up, YouTube? You already know who it is. Uh, yeah, YouTube. So, I finally made the proxies. Psych! Up yours, guys. <laughs> uh, but. Give me a second, I'm a little thirsty. Not like that kind of thirsty, but. H2O. And even for the thirstiest hoes. As you know, it's Valentine's Day. All my friends get in for their girls and shit. And they girls and stuff. But I ain't got nothing. I ain't got damn thing. How does it do with the fact that I don't have a girlfriend? Sucks. I should really start combing my hair out. Uh, get a cut. Well, I don't, I don't like getting a cut. I don't do it no hair. I think you guys see me a few times with no hair. I'm not sure of you two, but I just I like napping it sometimes. So it's a home of luxury. All day, and I got ugh, my hair is terrible. But card by Vanguard. I went for Liberators, the TD09 uh, set to come out. Yes, like the TDL9 set to come out. I'm waiting for that. So, yeah, I'm waiting for that. I, I really want the TDL9 set before, because, like, sometime this week or next week, I'll be making my first box opening video for Vanguard, stepping away from my Trapping King properties for a while, because that's just, like, really hard to do. Yes, yeah, so, like. Sorry, I sent off a message on Skype on my laptop to say, time I'm doing the video. Sorry if I'm being rude to you guys. You know, girls on that Valentine's Day. Talk about, oh, my boyfriend is everything. He didn't give me nothing. Oh, well. That's your problem. Don't come to me about it. But, uh, dang, I probably tried to fear freeze a bit. I just, like, was moving it around stuff. It was laying on my headphones. I wanted to really get it up. Yeah, so like, yeah, I'm making my first box opening video in about this, or probably like next week, or this week, I kind of got order it. I might just do a basic world paladins opening, because I don't feel like going to the uh, gold paladins. But like, I really don't like the gold paladins that much. I mean, like, they look cool, but like, I just don't like, I just don't like them. I just don't like, I just don't like the whole beast warrior concept. I don't like blonde lion Ezel, but I like platinum Ezel. Like I would just like to get a platinum Ezel just to be having it, you know. Dang freaking air itching crap. So like platinum Ezel is a pretty good card. Like I like the little break, like ultimate break. Like, I want that card. That's the only one. The whole freaking gold powder so I'll probably get is platinum Ezel. That lock ear, I don't know what you call that one, like. The one like bunny warrior thing, I do not like him at all. It's like, it's like little robotic servo ears and all that crap. I don't like that. And they gonna be loud as hell. Uh, yeah. Don't mind me just getting a pencil out. I don't see how loud this thing gets. I don't see how loud this thing gets. They're just talking. Hold on, YouTube. Okay, it just like doesn't show up in a little sound near bar, so they're good. Um, yeah, just give me a second, YouTube. Gotta pull out my notebooks and stuff. Gotta make a few pricing calculations right quick. Bring me just the camera. Make a few rights that look important to you guys. Gonna make a list of cards to get. Yeah. Ezo, Gold Paladin again. Invoice. It's the English wrong. G and H, Trade Places. English. Uh, this in. Okay, YouTube. Back. Sorry about that.
gonna keep the pins right here. Camera speed here is like really slow. So I'm just playing around the camera speed right now with the stuff that's my reaction. Okay, so uh Padma Ezel, I hate Lapier or whatever it's called. Um Let's see what else. Like the dogs and the gold powders are pretty cool. Like Sunor is cool. Like uh Galpha's pet is Sagamore. Sagamore that's a pretty cool card. I might add some on my deck too. Uh uh, I forgot that one the card the lion armor is that incandescent as a just like the one like I think it's a great two line, like you know, big lion body thing. Got that all going on. Yeah, hold on, I guess they're not another case for the labor all over me this Valentine's Day. Oh wait, that wasn't a hot one. Nice. Okay, so does so I want you guys to hit me up and tell me whenever uh the uh English edition of Li the Sanctuary Liberator Liberator Sanctuary or something because I actually get no like Japanese edition and, like two weeks later the freaking uh English edition comes out. I'm gonna be mad if I spent all my money and can't return it. And so yeah. And plus I'm just trying to learn the rules too. Like I'm watching a show like you know, like watch a show of a game, the rules are like real life, like you really don't like they will change like some effects abilities and like real life than what they do in the show. Like and uh like I am recording in here. Wow. I'm gonna hurt that woman. I am gonna hurt her. You too, you might be on time to support for murdering a woman tonight. Okay, YouTube, so, uh, liberate. I forgot what I was talking about. Thank you! I forgot what I was talking about now! I forgot what I was talking about now! Thanks a lot! You done distracted me! Okay, so, um, Sagamore, okay, yeah, talk about Sagamore and that one big lion armor dude. Yeah, the dogs and, like, the gold paladins rock and everything. Uh, the new episode of Vanguard comes out in two days. Two. Um, this video is sponsored by Nas and W.J. Jack. Jack, not Jack. Jack. Game, a fully played game. Um, I heard. So yeah, it's like right. yeah, so like more. I think it's an update on the proxy now. Uh, I actually did make like a proxy today. I made a quick like it was quick. I used scissors. I used kind of like hold on with those scissors. I made like I made like a real proxy, not like those paper ones. Like I mean, I material to make them better looking. I use like these scissors to cut out the card and everything. And, like I can have the materials. Like I had the stapler and I had the uh hold on YouTube trying to find you guys stuff and I'm trying to, I had the glue and everything I needed. Like I had all the things I needed to make the cards. Just like. Except for a few things, like I had enough stuff to the foil card, so yeah. Like, they messed up on the uh, proxy, so like, I guess when they printed out, it came out entirely too dark. So, whatever, so. There's a beta, they, another beta we found. Let me try to get it in the camera because I saw parallel. So, this is Soul Eater Griffin. It is Soul Eater Beast Griffin. Uh, clan, Parmenian, the Beast Clan. Uh, effects. Let me read the effects to you. I'll turn it around. Well, they got the back gun, but that came out entirely too dark as well. Too much glare. Sorry about that. All these windows open for lighting. Okay, the effect is this card gains 
1300 attack power for every primary and underside field. When they effed it up, because it's supposed to be like every card inside the purgatory, because the soldier beast here. Uh, the attack power is like, see, look, at the bottom, like attack power is supposed to be. Ugh. Up to up to like attack power, you can barely see that, like right there. Or like right defensive, or whatever. It's supposed to be 4600, but that came out turned too dark, so I got much on the contrast and stuff on that. Let's attack unit level 10. So yeah, and you can see like where I effed up like this edge is good, I kind of sat on it too like a dumbass. I will buy a dead box to keep these in, cause like I sat on it cause like it was like in my pocket and I guess it was like standing up like this, so when I sat down it's kind of like bent it in. But it held up pretty good for the glue, like yeah, if I cut it right, it would still be like, it has some bends in it, but you know. Like this side I effed up on. So like it's all curvy, as you can see, when it's supposed to be like straight down, like this side is. It's not all straight that side, but you can tell side, yeah, that side is straight. Good card thickness, see, I did to it. I did like a nice job to it on card stock. So like, yeah, I'm bringing you these illegal proxies, so you could buy these off of me while I'm finishing on my. All my videos, like I have stuff on the sides and stuff you see, so I got I use work scissors and stuff, paper trimmer. I'm actually ordering one offline soon. And that's what I'm waiting for. Yeah, I'm gonna the contrast and stuff so they come out better for you guys. <laughs> awesome for proxies. I'll teach you guys. I, I want to teach you step by step how to make the foils and like the, you know, little silver lettering and stuff on there and all that crap. I'll make you teach you how to make like the shiny background. I know I'm awesome. I'm gonna slice off my finger because I failed to make the proxies. Oh no, I hurt my finger. Psych. Uh, let's do the measurements of the cards, I guess. Okay, it's gonna take a six foot tape measure. Best way to measure it, I got the cards here. I'm not gonna, I can't hold it up. Okay, at least I don't think I can. Oh wait, never mind, I can. Okay, so let's do the width first. So the width is two and a half. I have a little crooked as so I'm holding the card and trying to watch the camera. So it's two and a half width, and it is three and a half inches tall. And I guess that's my video, guys. I'll come to you guys more on these updates.